Hey guys, welcome to the last episode of Music Video Show Songs and Memories. Uh, for a video challenge, I'm going to talk about songs on a music video show, and I'm going to talk about the memories you gave me. Now, for the final day of the challenge, day 31, I'm going to talk about Michael Jackson's Thriller. Uh, fun fact, that episode, Michael Jackson's Thriller, was supposed to be the last episode of the series, like the entire series, like after that episode, I was never going to do it, because seasons 5 through 7 just tore me a new one. Of It just, season 5 through 7 just tore out my enjoyment of the show, and so I was like, okay, I'm just going to cut back on season 8 instead of 25 episodes. I'm going to do 20 episodes, and this time they are going to be well-known music videos. I'm not saying like the videos I looked at before weren't well-known. In fact, a lot of them are. It's just that this time I'm just going to take it easy and make fun of videos that are much more well-known, and I'm going to cut back on the episode count. So 20 episodes in season 8, and then I am totally done. I'm just done with the music video show. And uh, Thriller is gonna was going to be the very last episode. And uh... It was going to be for about two weeks. It was going to be for about a week or so. Like, no, no, hold on. It was going to be. That was going to be it. After that, that 200th episode is going to be it. And then I saw Ariana Grande's uh, Thank You Next music video, and I'm like, oh my god, yeah. Yeah, I can't. I, I, I can't just sit here and just not let this thing... I, I can't not make fun of this. So I ended up just going for it and just go full-blown, like, attacking this Thank You Next music video. Because it it is a very... It's not a good video. But we're not here to talk about Ariana Grande. We are here to talk about Michael Jackson. And the memory gave me... I remember, like... It was back when, like, I still had, uh, on our disc, we still had the Greatest Hits album, which was, like, the two-disc album, which was, like, the first disc was the Greatest Hits, and the second disc was entirely new material. And I was more interested in the Greatest Hits, to be perfectly honest. And then we had Dangerous on CD, and then also we had Bad on tape. And uh, it was actually a really good thing. It was actually really uh, amazing. Uh, but the memories, I remember the memory, like, first time I ever watched the music video for Thriller was when I, we were, I remember when I was like six or seven, we were just about to leave to go somewhere, and I just saw this video, and I was like, what is this? And it turned out it was a Michael Jackson video, and it was Thriller, I'm like, okay, this is actually really interesting. And uh, I was like, okay, this is actually really scary. This is really intense. And then uh, just when we were leaving, the video ended. I'm like, oh, God, this is amazing. I'm like, oh, my God, this is actually really scary. This is actually, oh, my God. And so I was like, okay, I, I want to watch this video. I really want to. And then I never watched this video. I've never watched the music video again for another few years because I was born in the 90s. The Internet wasn't as it is right now. So I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna... And then eventually, one of our teachers ended up, um, in grade six, one of our teachers ended up with the cassette tape of Thriller. Uh, and we watched it, uh, just for our class. Like, for our entire class, we watched it. And the reason this song is actually so memorable is because like three, like in grade six, we have three sixth grade classes that are separate. Um, one of them was our gym, t ended up being our gym teacher because our cur our homeroom grade six teacher was um, had an injury and she couldn't um, participate in gym, and so our gym teacher was another grade six was uh, another grade six teacher, and he had the tape for Michael Jackson's Thriller, and we all watched it. And uh, we did end up doing a concert, like the three classes put together did a concert 
um, for it. Uh, in front of, like, parents and, like, students alike. Uh, a few of our classmates, like, three or four of our classmates who are girls, um, did these elaborate, not elaborate, but, um, dance moves that we all had to follow, you know, because, like, uh, I'm like, we're not going to do that, right? Like, they're showing us a presentation. And then we all had to do it. And so it's more like we were split into three separate groups here. Um, three or four separate groups. And uh, one group would dance to the first chorus, and then we all shift off, and then the, it will come to the next person, like the next group of people. Um, and to the next group of people, uh, to the second chorus second verse, and then they would go off, and then the third verse, there's a third group of people, it's like, okay, this is fine, and I didn't know how scary, apparently it was really scary, apparently, like, the night we did perform this uh, dance, it was actually really scary for my younger sister, and, uh, and she was like, and this was pretty much, like, the same sister who said, like, uh, she was in grade one or kindergarten when she saw her the night she was in the, night of the performance. Like we were all wearing scary makeup, we were all just walking along. We were doing our dance moves, and like apparently this actually scared her. And like it wasn't that scary. Like in my opinion, it wasn't that scary because yeah, it like again. Then again, I didn't read a lot of horror books, so it's like yeah, it wasn't that scary, but whatever. And so it's like yeah, we didn't. Eh, whatever. It's, <laughs> it's like, okay, whatever. And uh, she actually really was scared to the point where she's like, hey, um, like later on that night, she actually came over to my room and was like, hey, uh, I'm actually really a bit scared right now. And this was back when her and my other sister shared a room. Like, they both shared a room. And then she is like, okay, screw it. I'm just going to come sleep in the same room as my brother. Who, for some, who was part of that scary performance? But I'd rather just sleep with, like, in the same bed as him. Then again, this was the same uh, person who was like, "Hey, uh, it's like, this is the same person who was like, uh, yeah, um, I like one time. Okay, off topic, but one time I wanted to watch the first Lord of the Rings movie." And it was on TV that night. I'm like, okay, I'm going to watch this. And my dad's like, okay, but your sister has to watch it with you. I'm like, but why? She's just going to have nightmares and she's going to be scared. And she's like, he's like, he, my dad's like, she's not going to be scared. And then, like, yeah, she, I'm not going to be scared. And then, like, the movie was about two and a half hours long. And uh, I think at one point she did fall asleep. But, uh, she, like, later on, she was in my room, she, uh, I was about to go to bed, she was like, um, I'm scared, can I, can I actually come in and sleep in your bed, too? I was like, I'm like, okay, I wasn't even mad, I just wanted to say, Dad, I told you so. I don't want to say I told you so, but I told you so. I told you. And it was, and it was pretty good, like, that was pretty, that's, same sister, scared of the performance, uh, our school performance of Thriller, scared of the first Lord of the Rings book. I mean, movie. I mean, then again, yeah, I don't know how she, like, yeah, she probably did have nightmares. Because, honestly, I would have nightmares. She thought she was going to get a fantasy book, a uh, fantasy movie. And it was fantasy, but she didn't realize how scary it was. I wonder how she'd feel if she, like, at that age, she actually ended up watching the later Harry Potter movies. Or actually, what would happen if she ended up watching the other two Lord of the Rings movies? I mean, she's fine now, but, uh, again, kindergarten. <laughs> but, uh, Thriller, yeah, I still like it. Yeah, just memories of Thriller just reminds me of, like, my school performance. The very first time I saw the video of my sister being scared of both the performance and Lord of the Rings. That makes sense. <laughs> that's that's something to actually smile about. So um, that's that's pretty much it for another video challenge. Yeah, that's it for another video challenge. Um, thank you for coming throughout all of this.
and I will hopefully do another video challenge. Actually, I have a list for the next month. <laughs> I have a full complete list for next month. And then the month after, I have ha part of a list. So, um, thank you for watching this video challenge, if you watch this at all. And I will keep making things until I'm sick of it. So until then, thank you. And um, take care.